Brought to you by GTA, your island, your network. Former lawmaker Robert Klitsky was the guest of the Northern Guam Rotarians. Speaking out on the tax hike says he's done repeatedly of late at legislative public hearings. The temporary increase in BPT that went into effect April 1st is set to end on September 30. But Klitsky points out that history and logic will tell you the price hikes are here to stay. We went through this back in 2003. When the GRP goes back to the old level of 4%, there's no reason for any, you could never expect any businessman to lower his price because this is something that is sometimes forgotten. People are in business to make money. You heard it here first. <laughs> and adding insult to injure, he says, come October 1st, yet another big bite out of consumer pocketbooks. You're taking a higher price and then you're slapping a 2% sales tax on that as what Amir said. So it's a double whammy for those folk, again, for those folks who are least able to bear the tax. So Klitsky voicing the frustrations expressed by many, but it's not just the little guys that should be concerned. He says come October, the duty-free tourism mantra Guam's been pushing for more than 40 years will no longer apply. The price you see is the price you pay, but when we add a sales tax to it, it changes the marketability of shopping on Guam. To what extent? I don't know. I don't think it's the kind of thing that I want to be guessing about because tourism is everything. In sum, the bottom line for Klitsky? An effective, efficient government that provides basic services in accordance with the rule of law on at least a break-even basis. For Guam's News Network, I'm Nestor Leconto. Brought to you by GTA, your island, your network.